Alright, so <clears throat> I want to do a reading on that Will Smith and Chris Rock situation. Everybody wants to know if it's real, if it's real, was it staged? When I watched it, I thought to myself, it's staged, but that's so comical to say. Not comical like that. Oh my god, that was not the right way to say it. That is so common to say. <laughs> It was funny, though. It was comical. It was funny. It was hilarious. Okay, but um, it's I, I want to check. I want to check the tarot cards and see. So, spirit was the Will Smith and Chris Rock situation real? Was it staged or was it like his real true emotion? Like he really was raised and he really wanted to slap him. Ten of Cups, the star. Okay, I feel like it could have been. Ace of Cups, here in reverse. Okay, I don't feel like it was something that was planned with the Ace of Cups reverse. I feel like with this star, this is something that Will probably wanted to do. Maybe he always wanted to slap a comedian for saying, like, a bad joke. Or maybe he always wanted to slap Chris Rock. I don't know. I'm just getting, like, this is, like, a wish for him with the star. I do feel like he was protecting his family with the Ten of Cups. I do think it's real. I feel like this is something that he it's something that he wanted to do here. He wanted to protect Jada. I guess he looked at it as this is a, a good way to show... And prove that I love my wife here. Why is the star here, Spirit? The Four of Pentacles. I feel like he was holding back, though. Okay, but something about his marriage. I feel like Jada told him to do it. Okay, I feel like Jada told him to do it. All right? I feel like they could have... Chris and Will um, could have reconciled, made peace, and they did say that on the news, so I'm picking that up. But Chris is not fucking with him anymore. He's like, he didn't have to do all of that. All right, just just to prove it, especially if it is staged, especially if it was staged, Chris is saying he didn't have to do that. Okay, he could have slapped him pretty hard. That's what I'm also getting. Chris felt like, you know, he did do it for or publicity for fame, for money here, but Will is saying, no, that's not true with the sun here reverse. I feel like it is true. I feel like Will could have gained you know gain power off the fact that this will be aired everywhere because the star came out and I feel like it was a way to embarrass Chris I feel like this could have been some type of humil humiliation stunt that's why people are picking up a fraud because it was a stunt here but I feel like Will didn't, was not supposed to slap him I feel like he was supposed to say something rude okay he was supposed to say some other shit all right, I like caused an argument, an uproar. He was not supposed to slap him. So it kind of was a stunt, but then again, it wasn't because the feelings, the feelings is what make it not a stunt here because I feel like he definitely um tried it. All right, he, well, Will feels like he tried it here with his wife and I feel like Jada, uh-uh, first of all, spirit guys, protect me. Jada is a whole motherfucking demon out here. No offense to Jada, but sh I, I see it. All right. It, it's, it's like a goddess. It's a, it's, 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 a, it's a goddess, okay? I'm getting like, and it's, it's like a, a Jezebel type of thing. I'm here at Aphrodite, so she could, she may work with Aphrodite too. All right, why is the Ten of Cups here? Somebody was, I think Chris was even talking about jail. But Will would have had bail money. That would have actually made it even more, you know, better for the for the for the press if Will would have went to jail. I hate to say it like that, but that's just how they get down in Hollywood. Like it would have even made more publicity publicity like damn Will Smith went to jail because of Chris Rock. But then that would have gave um Will more publicity than Chris. And what I'm picking up is that Will is coming out with something new soon. So that could be why this happened. This could be maybe to grow rate ratings for his new show on Peacock. All right, I feel like there's a contract involved as well. But even if Will went to jail, he have enough money to get out. I feel like the the jail would even would have been that would have been staged for sure. That would have been staged. He probably would have just been like um registered in the jail system, but he wouldn't have been like in jail like an inmate. No. All right, they would have probably had his own little room set up if that's the case. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Cuz they you know he's a movie star, right? We have the world. Yeah, this is all over the news, everywhere. Yeah, it's just all over the papers. It could be in newspapers and shit, all over the blogs. Yeah, this is everywhere. I feel like it was a ritual. I do feel like it was a humiliation ritual, a stunt. Okay, a humiliation stunt. All right, and it, I'm hearing, it, it, it was accomplished, but it was also was a fail on Chris Rock. And I feel like he kind of sacrificed Chris Rock. I feel like Will also sacrificed Chris Rock as well. 
Ooh, I thought this would be a good thing to, to do, but I feel like I'm kind of exposing too much. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Jada do not like Chris. She did not like how he talked about her hair. I feel like that was a joke he was already making. And by him just saying it out loud in the crowd, they could have they could have made this joke in like their own little, you know, after party or before party, and you know, they was all in I'm seeing like them all in a group and you know, Chris making a joke about her hair. You know, she could have heard it, she probably didn't like it, and then he went on stage and did it. So that would just made it worse. Alright. So I feel like Jada's almost like that's what he get. She definitely pushed Will to do it. She kind of told him to just go ahead and do it. They probably didn't have that part in, or she gave him some type of signal to go ahead and do it here. We have the death. I feel like she honestly wanted to end his career. She may re remember this. I don't feel like she's going to end his career and moving forward, but she can. I feel like he's nervous now. All right, so he, that's why he's not dealing with them anymore after this. He's, he's grabbing his success and he's hauling ass. It's almost like he's not doing any deals with them again, okay, because that's a deal with that humiliation stunt. They made a deal together, and it was supposed to help both him and him, well, Will and Chris, okay, and then Jada was just in the midst. And it was a contract. They both got paid for it. All right, but what we're picking up collectively is the fact that it was a ritual, a humiliation stuff, a humiliation ritual. But it was real emotions, okay? It was real, like, he was, like, you know, about to slap you. <laughs> Why is the Ace of Cups here, reverse? Oh, we got the King of Cups here. I feel like this is real energy with the King of Cups. I know he's an air sign, but I'm getting, he's very neutral about it. You know, the King of Cups is very balanced in his, um, emotions and I feel like Will is not worrying about his career I feel like um at one yeah listen I'm somebody's a wizard I feel like Jada's Jada's a wizard here for sure they're be, definitely and her Ooh, I don't want to expose her daughter but I kind of just did by just saying I don't want to all right they're definitely magicians all right for some reason I just get like he's nervous and I'm hearing death threat oh my god let me just move forward some of y'all should watch the anime I think it's called death note or some shit like that where he will always write in his book Oh, different deaths and then it manifests. You <sighs> I don't know if that's what these elites do. If they have a book like that, I feel like, oh my god, I'm not about to get caught up. I'm already, I already was. Listen, I was already in a spiritual witness protection program. I'm not about to go into another one exposing these elites. I will in due time. But just, if y'all could read between the lines, then yeah. But just know, these animes be snitching. It's a good thing to watch them, all right? Because, you know, Asia is almost like a hub. Everything come out of there. So they kind of expose shit in animes. It's like how they expose shit in movies. So I feel like you guys should definitely continue to watch anime or watch some anime. The Death Note is definitely something that you guys should watch. Because I feel like for some of you guys, you got somebody doing some shit like that to you. Alright, and it's not working. Alright, and it's not working. But that have nothing to do with this reading. That's besides the point. Alright, I feel like that also ties in with the elites though. With the whole thingamajig I just said. Okay, but anyways, any final note, Spirit? I'm hearing Death Note again here. I don't know. I don't feel like that was good for... I, with that Death Note, that's the end of his career. There we go. Jada was going to end his career, yo. She was definitely not feeling it. I feel like she did not like that type of publicity, like you're making fun of her and her hair because of that whole alpecia thing. All right, I feel like it was that spirit that protects her. That demon spirit. I'm also getting Aphrodite again. Like I said, she works for her. She may give her beauty. Maybe Aphrodite may have felt some type of way, okay? Because she is surrounded by her. She does offerings for her and shit. Knight of Wands is here, though. Why is Knight of Wands here? Wow, this shit is crazy. I'm not really trying to be exposing Jada and Will spirit, but this is some... Because they should, mm, 
they shit about to fall too. That's why they doing this. That's why they did that stunt. They money ain't coming in. They revenue ain't coming in like how it used to. They money used to flow. It's not flowing how it used to. It's almost like their accounts could be frozen. All right, in a sense. I'm not about to expose them. I need like a Patreon or some shit to do that. This this needs to be like a Patreon session. I'm about to stop. All right, my, not a soul is here in reverse spirit. I'm putting out good energy that this be not start no conflict or controversy. I'm sure other readers will pick this up too. Okay, but with the Knight of Swords reverse, that's holding back. Yeah, that's Chris energy. I feel like he purposely didn't slap back because he wanted to keep it cordial here. But like I said. It's not that he didn't get paid for it with the Ten of Pentacles reverse. He just felt like he didn't gain anything out of it. You know, that's, yeah, Chris could have made a bad deal. He could be tied with Hollywood. His soul could be tied with them. But he's moving forward in the sense of he ain't dealing with them no more, like I said. Yeah, Ten of Swords. Devil's in reverse, though, so that's good for him. He's not tied to the contract. The contract is over, like I said, it's done. It was fulfilled, but... It was a humiliation stunt, and it was to humiliate Chris Rock. I feel like that could have been the secret thing. That's why it's the Ten of Swords in reverse. That was the betrayal that, you know, he was going to slap him. And I feel like that could have been their, Jada and Will's plan. Because like I said earlier, they could have he could have already been making jokes prior to them getting on stage and them sitting down. Okay, they could have been like in a group making jokes and shit. And she was just like, well, if he say it, on, if he say it again, slap him or some shit like that. Okay, she could have felt intuitively that he was going to make a joke about it. Or they, or he said it before going on, on the show that he was going to make a joke. So they could have planned the shit. Okay, but, um. I love you all so much. Namaste.